Hey friends, Twin Force Fusion here. Uh, just want to welcome all the subs and the no subs and the haters. I welcome you guys also. Uh, quickly, I was uh, just looking into the 2023 20, Ford Fusion. Uh, I saw a few, a few uh, spy shots of it. And uh, just before I go uh, to uh, meat and potato, I just want to show you uh, what's in Ford uh, Canada website for if you go for this is Ford Canada you see if I press here cars Mustang okay if I go Ford USA I go at cars Mustang only and just for hell of it I went to Lincoln Canada I went to see their vehicles and this is what they offer for their line and if I go to Lincoln USA, press their cars, and it's the same thing. So they all have SUVs and all that. So uh, if we, um, I heard that China, uh, even if, uh, f well, I was bummed when Ford said that they were sacking uh, the Taurus and the uh, Ford Fusion in North America, uh, but they said Europe will still have the Mondeo and I learned this year will be the last year of uh, the Ford Mondeo uh, They were thinking of uh, bringing a Ford uh, Mondeo Evos um, I'll show that a Few pictures of it pretty soon, but China will have it So I I, I was looking at it and I have my my own opinions obviously on it and um, So if we look here um, This is the uh, 2023 Ford Fusion spy shot the new sedan uncertain for us uh, Quickly look at it. Look at the wheels looks almost uh, more like a Lincoln and if we scroll down You could see it's a Lincoln Zephyr. So maybe in 2023 North America will have the Lincoln Zephyr So I'm just gonna close this um, This is a camo free Spy shots. Uh, this car was roaming in Michigan. Again, those wheels look pretty much a Lincoln. But if you will look at the logo here on the Amos Kia look uh, grill, and uh, there's a Ford. Uh, I think. Let me scroll down here. I'm gonna click on the pictures. Hopefully it works. And I'm just gonna scroll a few pictures here. Uh, they're in Michigan in winter. I guess it's not a few weeks ago. Uh, I could see the winter tires on the car Again, that looks a lot Lincoln-ish on the side there and the grill look at the lights there. We still have that reverse Nike Stuff that we have on our sport, but um, the shape is different. It's narrower and uh, The engine by the way if you're curious, it's the uh, the only engine I found was the two liter uh, EcoBoost with uh, you know about the I may get it wrong, but I would say 240 250 horse and 270 280 torque about that depending of the fuel you use obviously and um, kind of, Yeah, I don't know. It's a mix like I said of Lincoln and And the, the grill in the front. I'm still look, look at these pipes. My god. Uh, I have other pictures uh, of it Hold on. I'm just scrolling down here for C here Ford Mondeo they don't call it the uh, the fusion even if this is in Michigan you can see the license plate Michigan and there's some Chinese stuff here and I think it's like Evos um, look at those pipes my god all right so I'm just gonna close this window and um, let me see okay these are nicer my, look at the pipes. Uh, the reason I went there, I wanted to show the interior though. The interior is nice. Um, I, I think it's a hatchback now. It's like a crossover. I don't. I may be wrong. Uh, maybe not. There's no lines here, so it's just okay. So it's a sedan, but look at the interior. Very different. Look at that. Like a like a one huge screen. And these, by the way, that picture it's from. The uh, Ford uh, Mondeo Evos. 
and uh, anyway I found that very interesting the interior could tell you and this is all camoed up camoed up we'll see let's see if there's more pictures no? so no, it gives you an idea what it is and uh, this is the 2023 Lincoln Zephyr um, very nice I love this grill I dig that um, I'm not sure if this is all chrome and the light of the headlight at night a bit like the uh, new uh, Sonata Hyundai Sonata they have on the hood there uh, the light follows the chrome so maybe that's they're working on it but it looks very you know clean discreet I like it uh, I like this it's too bad again the only engine I saw in it was the two liter they didn't even mention the hybrid which is surprisingly uh, again the interior you could see that dash I see the Lincoln signature steering wheel but um, let me see if I could put the picture bigger here we go so that dash it's uh, I'm a guy who loves simplicity but I have to admit it's kind of impressive Wow Again, those Chinese mark on it and Zephyr, and it's a Lincoln. So very clean. I like it. Let me see if I do have another one. Ah, here we go. You could see clearly here the Ford Mondeo Evos. Uh, this caught my eyes. It looks a, a lot like that uh, Mach E. Uh, they just came with a crossover, and. Um, yeah, maybe it's not a crossover. It's still a sedan. If I look at the the opening of the the trunk here, uh, what else? Again, we see the same pictures. This is when Dearborn, Michigan. Yeah, I could see. That. Look at those pipes. What the hell they did that? What? Maybe it's a camouflage pipes because these these are just god awful. It will last one winter here in Canada with the salt. But. Uh, yeah, so kind of uh, curious of what's your opinion on it. Uh, again, a very sad. Oh, look at this guy. He's alone with a mask. This is the type of guy who, um, when he walks uh, in a regular sidewalk, he has these new um, seat belts that you could wear as a pedestrian. So, anyway, kind of interesting. I'm just curious. Uh, what do you guys think about that? Um, and you know what? Good for China if they still want those sedans because I, I'm a, uh, myself, I'm a sedan guy and uh, I'm pretty bummed out that pretty soon we won't have a lot of options. Maybe Genesis out there, which is a good car. And uh, I, for personal reason, I, I don't want any European cars. So we'll see. Uh, maybe the Lincoln Zephyr will be an option, but with just a two liter, I'm not sure. But uh, I'm getting older, maybe uh, I want to calm things down also. So that's it, that's all. And if you have any comments or opinions, uh, just uh, share it in the uh, commentaire. Take care, bye.